Today, WHO is publishing this year's global tuberculosis report, which shows a decline in new TB cases and deaths for the first time since before the COVID-19 pandemic. Meanwhile, the number of people being tested and treated is increasing, and research is advancing. For the first time in over a century, new effective TB vaccines for adolescents and adults are within reach. At least 18 vaccine candidates are currently in clinical development, including six in phase three trials. Last week, WHO launched a new report that sets out urgent actions to ensure equitable and sustainable access to and financing for new TB vaccines when they become available. Despite all this good news, progress is not victory. TB still killed more than 1.2 million people in 2024, which for a disease that's preventable and curable is simply unconscionable. Funding cuts to international aid in many low- and middle-income countries threaten to reverse the hard-won gains we see in today's report. It's therefore vital that countries step up domestic resource allocation alongside international funding.